Kenya to Colombia, from Iraq to Korea, in slums, in schools, in prisons, and in theaters. Every day, people gather at TEDx events around the world to hear the best ideas bubbling up in their communities. Today, you are part of a global conversation about our shared future. So what is this TEDx? TEDx is an initiative of the TED Conference, a nonprofit devoted to ideas worth spreading. We grant free licenses to allow TED-like events to spread globally. This event today is based on the TED Conference format and ideals, but is independently organized by your local community. So please make sure to thank the team of volunteers who worked so hard on today's event. It's their ideas dedication and time that made it all possible. It's they who booked all the speakers, and the views you'll hear today are of course those of those speakers, not necessarily of TEDs. But we hope their talks spark an exciting conversation among you. This is a day for curiosity and for skepticism, for openness and for critical thinking, for inspiration and for action. The more you enter into it, the more you'll take out. And now, on with the show. Today I'm going to share with you not only a brilliant business idea, but also a prospective solution. But also a prospective solution to uh, improve the cross-cultural communication and understanding. And before we get started, I would like to ask you a question about I would ask you to imagine that uh, when you lost in a foreign country, how can you how can you ask local for help without knowing language? Without knowing the local local culture, we might find it difficult to to present accurate information. The same problem happens in international businesses. Uh, we believe that co products have their own languages, cultural attributes like shapes, colors sizes, smells, and tastes. However, it's difficult for companies to make sure the products possess the possess their peripheral attributes, even for a giant company like Coca-Cola. In 1985, Coca-Cola had introduced a new flavor of Coke to winning back the lost market share from Pepsi. They failed to do so because the previous flavor, flavor is much more preferable than a new one. In this case, without communicating with the, with the market, Coca-Cola have lost $34 million of dollars in, market, in product researching, market, and inventory. However, simply rely on communication is far from enough for business to match the products to the market. And that's how they need also to consider cultural matching. Cultural matching is not just combine different cultures together rigidly, but digging up and appreciate the value behind the culture and then integrate the, integrate the value to the products and deliver the products to the, to the customers. To meet these needs, we build a cultural database the cultural database collects all the cultural information from USA, Japan, and India to support those companies who are trying to enter this market and introduce a new product. When a business enters a new market, they must push themselves to collect sufficient market information. However, it's risk-taking and time-consuming, just like our, how we build this cultural database. Because when they focus on working on the, or working on the market information, they might be suffering the risk that their market share are taken away by their competitors. In this case, as we all already possess the cultural database, the only thing left for us to do is to provide a solution to in integrate our database to their products and then match the products to the markets. To be specific, our 
our cultural database can help the business to integrate integrate their products with in their product researching process and manufacturing, retailing, dis distributing, and even advertising. For example, in the co in the product researching project, we we can we can cooperate with their product researchers and designers to come up with the most preferable preferable appearance of their products. At the same time, we also can help the business to improve their business model. For example, by applying our business, by applying our database to their company's human resource management, we can help them to improve their improve their reward system and performance management system. For example, we can help the help the company to improve their employees in working environment and also their non-financial rewardings. In addition, we can help the companies to improve their customer service so that they can have so their customer can have a better customer experience. We are so convinced that what we are engaging for is more than business, but spreading the thoughts that humanity and the cu culture need to be understood and communicated. In the future, we hope that our efforts can be somehow meaningful that this cultural database will not be trapped in computers, but it will spread the willingness of cultural communication and understanding, and we all share the treasury that cultural diversity brought to us, no matter our differences in languages, countries, and religions. Thanks.